Hello! In this lesson, we shall continue to look at equivalent fractions, but this time, we shall be finding missing numbers in equivalent fraction pairs. Let's have a look at some examples. I've got here an equivalent fraction pair, 2 thirds equals 4 over something, and I'm being asked to find the missing number. What I've got to be thinking is how did I get from 2 to 4 on the top numbers? I multiplied it by 2. Remember our rule, we must do the same thing to the top and bottom numbers. So if 2 is being multiplied by 2 to give 4, then we must multiply 3 by 2 to give 6. So the missing number is 6. 2 thirds equals 4 sixths. Now have a look at this one. 1 quarter equals something over 16. Now what I'm going to be thinking is how did I get from 4 to 16 on the bottom numbers? I multiplied it by 4. So if 4 is being multiplied by 4 to give 16, then we must multiply 1 by 4 to give 4. So the missing number is 4. 1 quarter equals 4 sixteenths. Well done. I'm sure you can find missing numbers in equivalent fractions. Go and have some practice now and I shall see you soon. Bye-bye.